The man you see here, Rolando Aldama Ocampo, was in bond court after confessing to stabbing a 22-year-old man in the chest, burying his body behind a North Charleston restaurant. News News' Matt Alva was in bond court tonight and joins us now live in the studio with details. Matt, he was in court, so what changed? Well, last night a judge granted a $5,000 bond for a cocaine possession charge and a $25,000 bond for a meth trafficking charge. But tonight, a circuit court judge denied bond on the murder charge. 35-year-old Rolando Ocampo confessed to burying the body behind La Bumba Bar and Grill just off Rivers Avenue. I am not setting a bond at this time. There will be no bond due to the nature of the offense. He was charged with murder, possession of cocaine, and trafficking methamphetamine. According to the affidavit, a 22-year-old man named Jose Castro went missing back on December 3rd. Authorities say two weeks earlier, November 17th, Ocampo and Castro got into a fight, and Ocampo stabbed Castro in the chest, killing him. Fast forward to this week. Police were at La Bumba following up on a burglary. But that's when Ocampo emerged as a suspect in Castro's disappearance. He eventually confessed to the murder and to burying Castro's body behind the restaurant. Authorities say Ocampo used pool salt in an attempt to mask and prevent the discovery of the body, which was dug up by police this past Wednesday. But despite a confession by Ocampo this week, on Friday night, he told the judge he was innocent. A Spanish translator was used in court. Thank you very much, but I just want to say that I am an innocent person. I am here because of other people. Last night, Ocampo went before a magistrate judge and was given a $5,000 bond for the cocaine possession charge and a $25,000 bond for the meth trafficking charge. According to the judge, Ocampo's next court appearances will be on June 3rd and then on August 19th. We'll have coverage of both of those. Live in the studio, Matt Alba, News 2.